The next one I'm going to show is how to uh, drag a file into Instructure, which you would then have them read, or refer them to a textbook reading, or refer them to some reading that they need to do on a website. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up my documents. In fact, I'm going to go to my computer here. Okay, so what I've done is I've, I've brought up my desktop, or this could be any of your documents. And uh, as you see here, I have these files. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag this over so we can see these at the same time. And I want to drag a file from my desktop into instruction. This is kind of a slick thing that I, I really like when I saw this added. Here's my files. And let's say I want this file and this file. I'm going to control click both of them and I drag and drop. And as you can see, it uploads two files. So now, if I want to create a new reading assignment, I'm going to bring this back here. And let's say I've already you already know how to create a reading assignment, so I'm not going to bother showing you that again. And I'm going to edit this page. And then maybe down below here, I want to have them read that file. So I click on that, and uh, this is an internship flyer we want to tell them about, and I save it. So now, if I were a student, this is what would come up. I'd click on that, and it just launches right into that PDF, and it's going to tell them about our internship thing. It, it's coming up on a screen over to the side. I, I'm not going to show you what that. Well, maybe I will show you the video. <laughs> so, um, this is a flyer for some internships at Starwood Hotels for our students. Okay, so you get the idea. It's really quite slick. I really like that feature. Uh, another thing that you can do, let's get in edit. Let's imagine there's a, um, a website you want them to, to, to go to and read something from. So, uh, let's say it's at duckdots.com. I'm going to add a link to a URL and I'm going to paste that insert link and there's your link sometimes it's also helpful just to show the name of the link because if students just see the word link it doesn't really I don't know they don't really like that too much um, so that's how you do that and so these would just be things that you can put into this assignment that they could watch a video you can type whatever you want in here you can link to a file which you've uploaded you can have them linked to another website. Okay, so I hope that's helpful. Aloha.